legislature would provide millions of dollars in cybersecurity upgrades to the state. One would hire, quote, ethical hackers, and the state would pay an outside company to try to break into state agencies, cities, schools, even election infrastructure. Yeah, KATV News Watch 7's Sean McKinnon talked with national experts on the need to safeguard all of it, even the food supply. You know, it's like Captain Kirk, the Starship Enterprise, the space, the final frontier. Well, this is a frontier that we have to combat. Senator Lauren Lippincott's not talking about space, but he is talking about technology and hackers. His first bill would spread $11 million across the state for cybersecurity upgrades. Is a clear and present danger for all of us. Even for Midwestern farmers, Sam Hunter with UNO's counterterror group, Ensight, says with equipment being remotely controlled, hacking puts America's breadbasket at risk. And ultimately disrupt the supply chain and the critical infrastructure of agriculture. Hunter says Nebraska needs to stay ready considering how fast technology is changing. So it's great to have the current capabilities that we have, um, but given the rise in trajectory, I would not be surprised that we need to increase our, our capability. Senator Lippincott's second bill would pay for the Nebraska State Patrol to hire ethical hackers. Hire 10 of them. I mean, that, that was my only, my only thought when I read that was just one, uh, yeah, get, get a team of folks to do it. And the idea is they can identify uh, potential problems and then turn around and, and say, I was able to do this, now go fix and, and patch that. Those good guy hackers would test the cybersecurity of schools, cities, and state agencies by trying to break in. Lippincott wants to go beyond that and test Nebraska's election infrastructure. The Secretary of State's office says it partners with Homeland Security, the FBI, and other national security agencies year-round, including presidential election years, to maintain and improve their current security protocols. I think it's only a good thing to, to add capabilities, given um, how sensitive a lot of these topics are. The more confidence we can give the public in, in our elections, the better. Sean McKinnon, KETV Newswatch 7.